Hey, how much does a polar bear weigh? What? Enough to break the ice. This is Damien. He's almost too grown to function. Nice to meet you. You knew. You lost. Where'd you come from? Oh, I just transferred in from Holy Cross College. Why didn't you just stay there? To be honest, I just want to get my MRS degree, and it's slim pickings over there at old HCC. Oh, you'll get your MRS degree, all right? A little slice like you. It's fine. Own it. I just my name again, Katie. Uh, actually, it's Caddy C A D Y. I'm gonna call you Katie. All right, Edwin. Follow me. Go that way. All right, where you sit in the dining hall is crucial because you have everybody there. This will help you. You got your typical middle school divided. You got the guys and the girls. Specifically, you got the overzealous freshmen, the marching band geeks, football team, folk choir, crew girls, the soaring guys, the lonely people with the observers, date table, creepy old lady in the corner, the coolest people you will ever meet. Yeah, and the worst. SPG, sweatpants girls, if you will. For the SPGs. They're like co-ed royalty. If ND was Us Weekly, they'd always be on the cover. First one, Karen LaForge. She's one of the dumbest girls you'll ever meet. Damien sat next to her in first year composition. She asked me how to spell orange. And the second one is Gretchen Walsh. She's totally rich because her dad built Walsh Hall. Wait, hold on, hold on. Isn't Walsh Hall like 200 years old? Details, details. Anyway, Gretchen Walsh knows everybody's business. She knows everything about everyone. It's why her hair is so big. It's full of secrets. And evil takes the form of Regina Ryan. Don't be fooled. She may seem like your typical selfish, North Face wearing, Ugg tromping hoe bag, but in reality, she's so much more. She's the queen bee. Hey, excuse me, we're doing a survey for new students. Do you have time to answer a couple questions? Okay. Has your roommate been screwed? What? Would you like us to assign someone to screw your roommate? Or you, while we're on the matter? Is he bothering you? Jason, why are you such a skis? I'm just being friendly. You were supposed to call me last night. Jason, you do not go to the Howard Hoedown with Gretchen and then scam on some poor innocent girl three days later. She's not interested. Do you want to go to the Keenan Disc Girl with him, grind awkwardly, and then never talk again? No, thank you. Good. So it's settled. You can go shave your back now. Bye, Jason. Wait, sit down. Seriously, sit down. Why don't I know you? I'm new. I just transferred into Holy Cross. Wait, what? It's the other college, literally across the street. No, I know what Holy Cross is. So you've never been to a real school before? No. Holy Cross. That's like really interesting. But you're like really pretty. Oh, thanks. Sue so you agree. You think you're really pretty. I, I didn't say I, I, I don't. Oh my god, I love your bracelet. Where did you get it? Thanks. My grandparents got it for graduation. That's so fetch. What is fetch? Oh, it's like slang from England. I picked it up when I was studying abroad in the London program. There was this one time where... If you're from Holy Cross, why are you literate? Oh my god, Karen, you can't just ask people why they're literate. You'll have to excuse her. She's a legacy. Can you give us some privacy for a second? Okay, so you should know that we don't do this very often, so it's kind of a huge deal. We want you to eat lunch with us every day for the rest of the week. Oh no, it's okay. Coolness, so we'll see you tomorrow. And on Wednesdays, we wear pink. Oh, and you should be aware of our other fashion rules as well. You can't wear anything nicer than jeans more than two days in a row. And I would suggest just picking up a bunch of sweatpants. Oh, uh, and anything North Face is a must. And um, you can't wear your hair down more than one day a week. So I guess you pick today. Dorm's really nice. I know, right? Hey, hey, hey! How are my best girlfriends? Hey, Ashley. This is Judy. A actually, I I'm Caddy. Hi. Oh my god. Hello, sweetheart. Welcome to our dorm. Oh, if you need anything,
something, just let me know. Don't be shy, okay? There are no rules in this storm. I'm not like regular RAs. I'm a cool RA. Right, girls? Please stop talking. Okay, I'm gonna make you girls a hump day treat. This is your room? It was our rectress's room, but I made her trade me. Uh, hey, can we put on We Are ND? Katie, do you even know who sings this? Uh, um, the Spice Girls? I love her. She's like a smick chick or something. Swish pan too. Oh, God, my hips are enormous. At least you can wear leggings. My thighs are huge. <sighs> Pride will still exist. My novelty rain boots are missing. My sweatshirt is too tight. <sighs> my nail beds suck. I have really bad breath in the morning. Ew. Gross. Hey, 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 happy hours from four to six. Oh. Thanks. There you go. Hmm. Um, is, is there alcohol in this? Oh, God, honey, no. What kind of an RA do you think I am? <sighs> Why, because if you want a little, I mean, the way these cops are these days, if you're going to drink, I'd rather you drink in the dorm. No, no, thank you. Okay, okay. Let's do it. Oh, so guys, what is the 411? <laughs> Tell me everything. How are your classes going? When's the next dorm party? How are your football seats? Ashley, um, will you go fix your name tag? Oh, oh, you girls came me so young. I love you so much. Hi, Mom. It's me. Yeah. This, this is not working out. Yeah, no, the class is really hard. And the people are insane! They're nuts. I miss junior college. Can I go back? <laughs>